This semester, you may have noticed something different in the cub that didn't used to be there. That'd be a large napping pod. At the beginning of the 2015-2016 school year, there was a survey sent out to WSU students to find out what they wanted to see in the Chinook facility after completion. With many options, the students seemed to respond well to the idea of napping pods. Some of the top responses. One of the top responses was napping pods, so that shifted a little bit into the, the steering group in that the Cub and UREC became kind of more partners in not only the management, but then the development of this facility. Here in the Cub, we have one of the first prototypes of the napping pod that voted by students was one of the most popular features that will eventually go in the Chinook. This particular pod has some pretty cool features. For example, it plays music inside the hood when you're sleeping. It also gives you a gentle back massage when sitting down. Although students seem to be responding well to the prototype, how do they feel about the cost? I guess it was really popular, um, but $10,000. That seems a little steep um, for how useful it is. If you want to take a nap, there are plenty of places around campus you can just conk out for a half hour. Although this is just the beginning of the process to find the perfect napping pod for students, a concern of many students is how many pods will be available for use once they are installed. Um, it's not determined for sure yet right now. It looks like so probably be somewhere in the range of 10 to 15, but the, the exact number hasn't been determined yet. When the Chinook is finally open, it will only be accessible to WSU undergraduate students. With the limited access to the building, it will help ensure that the individuals paying for the construction of the facility are getting their money's worth and are able to take a nap at their convenience. Reporting for Murrow News Central, I'm Haley Paul.